hello everyone and welcome back to this video so in today's video tutorial i'm going to show you how to buy new tokens before they are listed for trading on centralized exchanges using metamax and trust wallet in case you don't know already metamax and trust wallet are decentralized wallet okay where you can trade some of these tokens before they are actually made public so if you are new to this channel make sure that you hit that subscribe button okay and the notification bell so that you'll be the first to be notified whenever we create you know um educating videos like this and whenever we go live trading on this channel all right you can equally use the link in the video description to join my community on telegram currently this is the token we are going to buy all right this token is only traded on you know pancake swap which is um a decentralized exchange okay so we can use metamax to connect to pancake swap or use trust wallet to connect to pancake swap okay so this token is what we are going to buy a friend recommended it i bought already and i'm as i speak with you okay i'm already in profit i'm going to buy more just to show you how this work okay so first what you want to do is to come down here to copy the contract address for this token which is this one here this is the contract address and you just need to click on this icon down there okay to copy the address so we'll go ahead and click on it and then you see it says copied all right now we need to go to metamax and try to connect to this platform and buy the token guys so here i am on my metamax wallet in case you don't know already how to set metamax i will leave a link in the video description so that you go ahead and you know follow the guide there to set up your metamax wallet now on the metamax you have different networks okay that you can actually use on metamask so currently i am on the binance smart chain network now on metamask i can have access to all of this network i can even add more networks all right so i can use metamask to transact with any related um, ethereum related you know project the linear project binance smart chain polygon arbitrum and others okay i can add a lot if i want to add even the solana and other networks i can go ahead and add them but currently this token we want to buy is on the binance smart chain network so you make sure that you select the binance smart chain network and now when we select the binance smart chain network whenever we are trading on metamax or trust wallet okay if we are trading on the any project that is related to binance smart chain network we need bnb to pay for gas fee so if you want to if you don't have you know bnb already you just copy this address okay go to your exchange for instance you go to buy bid buy bnb and you can withdraw that bnb using bep20 this address is a bep20 address okay withdraw that um, bnb there and you'll be able to receive that bnb on this wallet so it is that bnb you use to pay for gas fee it is equally the bnb you use to be trading now when it is on the ethereum network you need ethereum to pay for gas fee you equally need Ethereum to, you know, pay your transaction, uh, buy your tokens and all of that, okay? So those are the ways these things work, all right? So if it is on the Polygon network, definitely you'll be needing Matic on your, you know, network. But right here we are using the Binance Smart Chain. Make sure you have BNB here to be able to transact and buy this particular token, all right? So with that said, now we want to buy that token. So the next thing we need to do is to go, I, I do have BNB on my wallet already, okay? So is to go ahead and click on this icon here, right? This icon here, that is, that is the one you are going to click. And that is where you can access any browser, any website on the Metamax app directly, okay? Here where it says search or type your URL, you go ahead and type. Now, this token is being traded on PancakeSwap. So we are going to type in here pancake swap okay so even if you don't have the address of the website in full okay just type it maybe if you have done that already to pop up here or you just type and search and you'll be able to click on the first link there on google on google search okay so we'll go ahead and click this second one here we want to transact okay uh on interact with with uh, pancake swap so go ahead and click on that and that will go ahead and load up pancake swap website for us all right now that the pancake swap website has loaded okay what we need to do right now is to click on connect wallet okay so go ahead and click to connect this to our metamax and then you go ahead and select your wallet okay in this case i'm using metamax so select metamax so we'll go ahead and click on metamax and then this pops up just click on connect and your wallet will be connected successfully so our metamax wallet has been connected successfully so the next thing we need to do now that we've connected our wallet successfully is to click on this trade option okay 
just go ahead and make sure that you click on that trade option now when i click on the trade option this pops up okay this dialog box pops up now we have bnb here which is what we'll use to buy this token then we have by default the cake token so we select that cake okay click on the cake and since i've copied the contract address for the token we want to buy already all i just need to do is to go ahead and paste that address here okay once i paste that address there you will see the token will pop up here okay so all you just need to do is to go ahead and click on import so we'll go ahead and import this token and then here you scroll down and click on i acknowledge okay so you click on this i acknowledge the risks just make sure you check that box once you click on that box then you go ahead and click on proceed okay and that token will be imported into um your account okay into the bank swap platform now to buy this all right to buy this you go ahead you can use okay either 25 percent of your account 50 percent 75 percent or even max don't use max because you equally need the bnb to pay for fee okay so i'll use 25 percent of my bnb to buy this token and that will cost me around ten dollars okay as you can see there 25 percent of my bnb will cost me around ten dollars and that will give me around this number of this token that is over six thousand plus or thereabout okay if i go ahead if i decide to use um 50 percent okay that will be around 20 something dollars and this is the number of the tokens that i'm going to receive okay so if i go ahead and click on the, let me just use 25 percent guys okay now once i click on 25 percent and then i scroll down here you'll see the option where it says swap okay just go ahead and click on that swap option and then once you click on swap go ahead and click on confirm swap okay now it says unknown error whatever click on dismiss so guys when you keep trying and this thing doesn't work you keep trying and trying and trying okay let me go ahead and type 100,000 of this token and see what will happen. So this token is actually getting expensive. The last time I bought, I bought at $14. Now it is uh, $16. Okay, let's see. Let me try again to swap. Go ahead and confirm swap. Okay, so it means that you need to be buying from 100,000 and above, okay? You need to be buying from 100,000 and above. So yeah, 100,000 is working. Let's go ahead and click on confirm. Once this pops up, okay, just click on confirm down there and that will go ahead and, you know, buy that token for you. Yeah, transaction received. So we need Metamax to confirm that that has gone successfully. And um, I think, uh, yeah, look at it. So Metamask just popped up that the transaction has been completed successfully. Okay, guys. So the quantity you equally buy equally determines, okay, how this um, plays out for you. And um, basically, that is it. All right. Now, if I come back to my wallet by clicking on this icon on Metamask, I should be able to see that token reflecting here on my account. All right. So you see here that initially I had over... Um, 90,000 now that I've bought the 100,000 that's added so it's supposed to be more but there is a tax okay the four percent tax or whatever whenever you are buying all right all right so that is basically how you buy this token on you know the platform if you want to sell back the token okay you can equally go back to that browser option this option here and then here you can just click on this arrow let's say I want to sell back to BNB okay I can just click on this arrow so this time around, we have our token up here, and then we have BNB down there, all right? So if I go ahead and click on max, it will select all the number of tokens that I have. And then here, I can decide to do what? To swap back this token to BNB, and it will give me this, all right? It will give me this, and all of that. If you are satisfied with that, go ahead and swap it. That is, if this actually increases in profit, that is how you are going to swap it. You can equally swap this to USDT if I select BNB, if I click on BNB here, I think you can equally select USDT here. So, uh, yes, I have USDT there already. So you have USDT here. If I select that USDT, let's see. Yeah. Okay. So that will equally swap this directly to USDT for you. Let me equally see if you can buy with USDT. Okay. So here, I think I can equally buy the token with USDT, right? Yes, I can buy the token with USDT. So if I go ahead and type in another 100,000 of this token here. Let's see. Let me even do um, 500,000 this time around and see if that will work. 
So 500,000 will cost me around $80, right? It will cost me around $80, and then I'll go ahead and click on swap. So you can equally buy with USDT, guys, okay? If you have USDT on your Metamax wallet, you can equally buy with USDT. Now, if I go back to my wallet here, and you want to deposit USDT here, just make sure that you click on this, okay? And make sure it is BEP20 because we are, you know, working with the Binance Smart Chain. So whenever you copy this address, whether it is USDT, whatever token you are sending here, it has to be on the Binance network so bep 20 is what you'll be using now when you buy any token and the token is not showing up here guys okay or you deposit tokens here and they are not showing like usdt is not showing it nothing else is showing here guys okay all you just need to do is to click on import token right once you go ahead and click on import token let's click on that so once you click on the import token you come in here make sure you click on the custom token okay once you click on the custom token, make sure that you have copied the contract address of that token already. So if it is Ethereum, the same way I copy that address from CoinMarketCap, okay? That's the same way you copy the address for that particular network. So if we are copying address for, you know, Ethereum, it has to be ERC20. If we are copying for Binance, it has to be the BEP20 and all of that, okay? So here I'll go ahead and, you know, put that token here. All right, that is the contract address. Once you paste that address there, click out. All right, automatically it will fill this option, the ticker and then the token decimal for you. And all you just need to do once that is filled up, scroll down here and click on import. All right, I cannot import this because I've already imported it already and all of that, all right? So the token will now be showing up here and you'll be able to see the number of the token you bought right here. So that is how to use Metamax to buy any token on PancakeSwap. The same thing happens if you are buying on Uniswap, on Dex2, any of the decentralized exchange, okay? Just connect to it and you are good to go. The next thing is Trust Wallet. Let's go to Trust Wallet. All right, guys, so here I am on my Trust Wallet, and once you come in here to Trust Wallet, make sure that you deposit, okay, um, some tokens into your Trust Wallet, that is BNB or any other network that you want to use, okay? So to be able to deposit, just click on Receive, okay? Once you click on Receive, you will not be able to select the token you want to receive, so just select the BNB Smart Chain, okay? Select this one that says BNB Smart Chain, all right and then you'll be able to copy your address here just copy that address and then go to your exchange to withdraw make sure it is bep 20 you are withdrawing bnb okay and then you'll be able to deposit that into your bnb now once you make deposit here to be able to buy this token just come to this last option here that says browser okay where you have browser click on it and here on the browser you want to scroll down i think there's pancake swap here yes you scroll down here until you see pancake swap okay so once you scroll down here you see pancake swap here. if you don't see it just type it on the search bar here and you'll be able to see it so if i go ahead and click on pancake swap that will be able to load up the pancake swap website for us now once the pancake swap website loads up all you just need to do is just to click on connect to connect to your um you know trust wallet so just click on connect and then you go ahead and select trust wallet here okay so click on connect and then click on connect all right, so your wallet has been connected successfully. Now you can now use this. The same thing I showed you initially, okay, is the same way. Just connect and then we have BNB, then we have the cake option. So let's go ahead and change that from cake to the token we want to trade. So we'll go ahead and paste that contract address we copied earlier, and then the token should be able to pop up here. All right, so the processes here are just the same. Click on import and then scroll down here, I acknowledge, and then click on proceed and you are good okay so here we can use like 75 percent of our bnb all right and buy this token we don't have enough bnb on trust wallet so there you can be able to go down and then click on swap okay so the process are just the same all right just that you have a different platform but the processes of buying the tokens are all the same okay so that is how you actually trade using you know metamax and trust wallet to buy any token that has not been listed on any exchange for trading yet and the good thing is when this trade uh, when these tokens are finally listed on exchanges you are buying it here very cheap you'll be able to sell them there at a higher price and make some profit even if it is not listed on exchanges okay once the price increases and you want to take profit you come to this 
swap option and then swap back to either BNB USDT and you take your profit and off you go. I hope this video is helpful. If it is, give it a thumbs up, guys. All right. And don't forget to join us on Telegram to learn more. Okay. Links to sign up for Bybit and other exchanges are in my video description. So make sure you go and sign up and join me on Telegram. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.